Oh, there. Actually, I think it was that one. I was going to say that. Yeah. Oh, wait, another video. Wait, another video. It's pretty quick, though. What's that? It's pretty quick. Probably going to have a sequel of the database. What's that? To store cash and like cookies and stuff? Yeah. It's unnatural. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, first things first, Marvin is going to explain how he wants you to set up for this 360 camera. Make a circle around, so make a circle around it. Try to look missing. It's already taken. Oh, I didn't say that. Alright. How is that even possible? Is it moving? Alright. So it's 8 p.m. Way to go making it this far. My name is Mateo, for y'all that don't know me. I help lead Open Austin. Um, yeah, so you guys know the drill that, that participated this earlier, This, uh, I guess in two. Um, please say your name, the project you're working on, um, talk about the overall status, talk about obstacles you're facing, and definitely let us know about some um, things you need help with. And on top of that, um, before, actually before we go around, there's some announcements, like I guess regarding the project presentations tomorrow. We want to make some announcements about how that's going to work so that you're prepared. Because kind of at this point, or especially in the morning, you're going to want to uh, have some people focusing on delivering that presentation. Um, so we have, we have the library until 10 p.m. Um, you know, this is kind of the last check-in of the day. So maybe some of your folks will start scattering. Maybe you want to keep working later. There's recommendations on places close by to go continue working. You don't have to do that. You can go get some rest. That might be even more important. Um, other announcements. Okay, so here's how tomorrow is going to work. Um, at 9 a.m., we're going to have a check-in, kind of like this. It's optional. Um, but the main thing we want is for you to confer confirm that you want to give a presentation. Um, so if you're not here at 9 a.m., send us a Slack message. Let us know as soon as you can that, yes, my project team is going to present, um, and we're ready to do that. Or we're, we're getting ready to do that. At 11, we're having our final call for presentations. This is... Uh, not an optional check-in, this is a mandatory check-in at 11 a.m. tomorrow, and we're gonna be in the gym to do it because we're, we want each team to plug in to the projector and make sure we don't have any glitches along the way because we have a really short time uh, to present each project. So um, we're moving lunch to uh, basically as soon as we can before noon, and then we're gonna, we, on the agenda, you would have seen that the presentation would start at one, but we wanna give y'all more time. So we're gonna start at noon, okay? So that kind of changes the day a little bit. Um, and yeah, and then we'll still plan to close by two. And you will have 45 minutes for lunch. Uh, lunch will be here by, ready to go at 11.15. Awesome, cool. Um, so about those presentations, um, you will have two minutes to present, which is really short. Um, we're gonna give kind of like a leeway of like a minute or so, and that's gonna include things like setting up your computer so the quicker you can get in to do that, the better. Um, just like this morning, there will be kind of the flags to let you know how much time you have left. Um, so if you know if you want to demo your work, you, it might be better to like capture a screenshot of that or like you know something a little more predictable beforehand. Um, that's up to you and, and how you want to deal with that. Um, it's also you don't necessarily need to have a visual. Um, you could, I mean, I think you might want to, but that's also optional. Um, I think that's the main things you need to know for now. Any questions about that? So hard cut off on three minutes. We really want you to have a good two minutes to give your presentation and then that minute to do transfers so that everyone gets a chance. Uh, tomorrow, it opens at 7. What time do we open tomorrow? Doors open at 7. Um, and I know there were some hardware projects. Um, I know the VR, you had mentioned something. Yeah, it takes longer than two minutes to like... Get yeah, so I guess we can talk afterwards yeah. about how you want to try to give yeah. the best presentation. So that's really what the focus is going to be at the 9 a.m. and the 11 a.m. check-ins tomorrow is seeing what y'all need in terms of getting your presentations ready. Any other questions about that stuff? I'll piggyback off that. As a judge, if you guys want to chat with me tomorrow morning after we figure all this stuff out, just ping me on Slack or come find me. I'll be here for the 9 a.m. and I'll be here for a little bit longer if you want to talk to me tonight. And I'll help you if you have questions about versus visuals versus just talking versus what you should say. 
um, to make sure your two minutes actually works. <laughs> yeah. Um, so we are yeah, judging. I'm gonna stand off this. Uh, there's 50% practicality and 50% execution. So from a practicality perspective, is it viable in the market? Will people use it? And why would they use it? Um, and then from the execution standpoint, how much do you have done and how much will be done if you continue working on the project, say for a week or a month or this and that? Um, so I know some of you I've talked to and you have large visions of your project and I told you to scale back and find like the core things about it and knowing that you can add things on afterwards. Um, so that stuff helps us in judging as far as the sustainability of it. If you have a working model and you know that you're gonna be adding to it, awesome. We'll wanna know about those additions and where it's headed, but if you have something early on that's tangible, obviously it's helpful. Yeah, and so like the general things you probably wanna communicate in your final presentation is like, what's the problem we try to solve? What was hard? What did we learn? And then like, you know, what's next? And then somewhere in there, you'll tell the story of what it is. Can you repeat those things that you're looking for again? Um, practicality and execution. So, and the judging packet's on the general channel. If you okay. search, oh, cool. yeah. I have a packet right here if you guys want to look at it too. Yeah, so um, Fresh Form, they were here earlier. So they're going to be kind of giving a I would say around five to six month marketing campaign. So getting like branding, identity, website, domain, everything um, to really showcase your project and how we merge with your current website. So they're gonna help you. It's you know five, six month campaign and working with Scott on that. Um, obviously we'll tailor it to what the project is and what you guys are looking for and how we can make that, that work. What were the it's four? Um, so there's three other side ones. There's best use of data, most hack forward, and best design. Sorry, what was the second one? Most hack forward. Okay. And what we're thinking that is you came up with a very vague idea just this morning, and you've actually gone leaps and bounds to come up with a product that works really well. So yeah, the, the judging packet is on the general channel. If, if you want to see that or you can't find it, let me know. We'll, we'll show you that. That could help. Uh, with the presentation. So, are there any other questions about the presentations or kind of the rest of the night tonight or tomorrow morning? Cool. In that case, we can go around again your name, project, um, how's it going, what's hard, what did you help with, that kind of stuff.